819 new this morning. It is our region's largest entertainment venue, the Virginia Beach Amphitheater. The season is now over, but we are learning major renovations are planned there. Yeah, this is big, but who's going to pay for it all? Then on your side's Brett Hall joins us this morning with that answer. Bianca and Katie, the amphitheater is owned by the city of Virginia Beach, built in 1996, but operated by the largest entertainment company in the world, Live Nation. Now, according to city documents, when it comes to large maintenance projects, the lease, that means it's the responsibility of the taxpayers to make those major adjustments. Tonight, Virginia Beach City Council is expected to approve $1 million in funding to allow for the replacement of infrastructure that has reached the end of its useful life. The amphitheater just completed its 25th season, not including the year COVID-19 kept it shuttered. Plans call for the replacement of the roof, generators, HVAC systems throughout the facility, as well as the installation of LED lighting in the parking lot. Now, originally the plan called for the American Rescue Plan Act money to go towards this, but Councilman John Moss and Linwood Branch, they both brought forward a substitute that's on tonight's city council agenda that would use the tourism investment program to cover those costs. That is made up of no real estate taxes or property taxes. Rather, it's the taxes you pay on your tickets, as well as food, hotel taxes, and cigarettes throughout the city. Those will pay for the improvements. And the amphitheater seats around 25,000 people. Mm -hmm. um, its season starts up again, usually in April, even though it can be, if it was weather like this right now, that'd be quite chilly. Uh, but uh, the, so these are going to be done as well as other projects that Live Nation will do. They actually split some of the costs mm -hmm. of, of improvements at the facility, but uh, these will be the major ones that we know about. Well, safety is key, so yes. we'll have to see what City Council decides in the final decision tonight. Yep, that's tonight. All right. Thanks, Brad.